Hello, you beautiful, beautiful, lovely people. I'm Michael Botts, and the reason you show up here every morning at 9 a.m. is because you know there's more. Down in here, for a long time, you feel like, ah, I've got more to give the world. And you also know that when you give that more, you're going to get more. And that knowing, that down in here, that knowing, it's, it's heavy, it's exciting, it's discouraging, it's all this stuff. And the whole purpose of this show is to help you get to that. Look, you were born genius. You were born Good morning, good morning, good morning, Jose, Mindy, Michelle, Kathy, good morning, Eliza, that's uh, Robert Russell, I think, nice, nice, good morning, everyone. Look, you were born genius, you were born to change the world, you were born with boldness and certainty and the ability to impact the planet the way you, only you can. There will never be another you in the future. There has never been a you in the past. So the reason you're here is to impact the world only the way you can. So you're born on the beach of I'm Enough. You're going along, you know, learning to walk, learning to do stuff. Michelle's already got her grateful out there. <laughs> Michelle says, I'm grateful for people who push me out of my comfort zone. I'm proud... I missed it. Hang on. I'm proud that I had courage to do do it, and I am enough. Good job, Michelle. Good job. Good morning, Kathy. Good morning, Billy. Good morning, Sheer. So you're going along on the beach of I'm enough, and then you get caught in the riptide of life, and you get sucked under into the ocean, out in the ocean of am I enough. And you're out there in the ocean of am I enough, and you're like, it's getting sucked under and smashed against a coral. And you're trying to find out, how do I succeed in this? And you start to breathe in doubt and fear and limiting beliefs. And you start to live your life out of doubt, fear, and limiting beliefs. And you're still trying to succeed. You're still trying to be a great parent, trying to own your business, trying to be a great spouse, trying to be a great daughter or son, trying to be great at everything, but it's... It seems like you just keep running into the walls and falling on your face. Well, here we pull you out of the ocean of my knife, drag you up onto the beach of I am enough and start to resuscitate you. And you spew out fear. You spew out doubt. You spew out limiting beliefs. You vomit limiting beliefs out of you. And you start to walk up. You get up and you start to breathe in confidence and certainty the way you were born. And you start to walk down the path of success, the path of your destiny in a way that you have not maybe ever walked down the path. Now, what do we know about the path of success? It is paved with gratitude. Gratitude is the foundation of success. So right now, Michelle's already on top of it. I love that, Michelle. She was first one here. She got her grateful in. Right now, you put your gratefuls in. She, she did a great example. I'll do mine. I'm grateful that I had the patience and the ability to pull my tire off my van, plug it, and put the new tire on. Everything was stuck. The mechanic said it couldn't be done, and I was able to do it. I'm grateful that that happened. I'm proud that I did it because, you know, that's not really my thing. <laughs> and I am enough. That's how you type it in, okay? You type it in. Good morning, Caitlin. Glad to see you here this morning. So you type in your gratitude now, all right? I am grateful for, I am proud of, and I am enough. The I'm grateful for is so that you start to feel the gratitude, because in, in an attitude of gratitude, you have abundance. The I'm proud of is so you recognize you're awesome, but also we get to learn from you. We get to learn from you when you say I'm a proud of, okay? So you start to do those, type those in, make sure you say it out your mouth. Now we're going to take some breaths. The purpose of these breaths is to create space. Because we got kids and we got jobs and we got traffic and we got to get our coffee and we're rushing to do this and we got deadlines and all that makes us tight. 
and then we can't see the obvious that's in front of us. I don't know if you guys saw Michelle's coaching session last night, but she had every answer inside of her. But she had to take some deep breaths and create some space to get to see the answer. So let's do that. Ready? Breathe in. Just exhale doubt. This is an important part of the show, guys. This is really where all the magic happens. Mindy says, I'm grateful for good old-fashioned physical label. It reminds me that I have no limits except in myself. I am, a, I am enough. Amen to that. Amen to that, man. My grandfather, that dude could outwork anybody. And he loved every minute of it. <laughs> I'm with you on that one. All right, breathe in. Exhale. Where do you guys feel it? For me, I feel it in the back of my neck and my shoulders, and then I feel like it just comes off of me and the anxiety and the stress fall off of me onto the ground. I want to know where you feel it. Do you feel it here? Do you feel it here? Do you feel it in your tummy? Where do you feel the space start to happen? Just write it in there. Type it in there. Ready? Breathe in. Just exhale limiting beliefs. I need this every day. <laughs> you guys think I come here for you? I come here for me, man. <laughs> I come for me to get me right. <laughs> Ready? Breathe in. Exhale. I feel the space happen as the stress escapes from my shoulders and neck. Good, Caitlin. I love that. I love that. Thank you, Caitlin, for, for participating. Billy Barlow, I love it when you come. I'm happy you're here. Guess what, people? There is no coupon for success. I want you to think about that. When I was um, negotiating for this live event I'm putting on June 23rd, it's an all-day event, um, I went and I talked to the woman about you know, renting the room. And she said, well, it's this price. And I said, okay, let, you know, let me see it. Let me check. I checked three places. It was the best price. It's where my spirit told me to do the event to start with. And so I negotiated with her. I said, hey, how about this price? And, you know, and then I'm telling her why. I'm negotiating with her. I'm saying why she should do it. Because then she has the, she don't have to worry about that day being full. We're going to fill it. We're there from nine to five. She's going to have a whole bunch of people there. They have a restaurant. We're going to probably eat at her restaurant. So I was trying to sell her on it. I was negotiating with her, right? And I got the price down a little bit for that live event. And I want you to know that when it comes to success, there is no negotiation. There is no coupon. You can't pay half price for your success. Kathy says, I'm grateful that my daughter is out of ICU and I will be able to come back home soon. Diabetes out of control, and I am enough. Good, Kathy. I'm glad that happened for you, too. Remember, you are strong. You are powerful beyond measure. So we can't negotiate with success. Success has all the cards. That's the beauty of it. When you go in to buy a car, the guy with the car wants your money. So you have some negotiation. But success has all the cards. Like, success has it all. So we cannot go to success and say, hey, how about I do this halfway and I pay half price and you give me all the success. And success is like, sorry, that's not how it works. <laughs> Billy Fosna says, I'm grateful for an alarm on my phone. Proud I learned it. I am enough. Nice. She's learning technology. Good job, Billy. So I think a lot of times because we're living out of am I enough, we start to negotiate with success because in our brain, in am I enough, we think we can't do the full price. We think, the reason we're negotiating is because we think we can't pay full price out of am I enough. I want you to think about that. When you start to negotiate, 
when you start to consider the price, how much is it going to cost me to succeed, you're living out of am I enough? Because I am enough would be like, okay, success, whatever the price, I'm willing to pay it. Whatever the price, I'm just willing to pay it, success, because I know I am capable of whatever you ask of me. And see, you didn't have this as a baby. A baby never asked, how long is it going to take for me to walk? A baby never asked, how long is it going to take for me to talk? Babies don't ask these questions. Because you weren't born, you were, I mean, you were born in I am enough. So, whatever the price, you were like, no problem. I mean, think about it. Think about a seven-year-old. If we sat down in a seven-year-old and said, okay, you have to make these 20 phone calls and you have to talk to these humans and you have to offer them whatever you're selling. The seven-year-old will be like, no problem. I'm going to knock this out. But then we turn into a grown-up and we're like, oh, can we do ten, Can we do eight phone calls? Um, what if they're not there? Do I have to leave a message? That's all out of am I enough? Because in I am enough, we are willing to pay full price and we know we are capable of paying full price for success. So I want you to think about your dream and your destiny and how maybe you've settled and lowered your standard for success because you're living out of am I enough and you're negotiating for success. You want a coupon. Out of am I enough, you, you're looking for a coupon for success. How can I get the best deal? How can I pay a discounted price? How can I, is there a shortcut? You know, I, I used to be in um, um, a multi-level like direct sales company. And the question everyone always asked was, how many people do I have to talk to? That's negotiating with success. And, and that would go for any business. I'm doing this live event. How many people do I have to offer these tickets to before I fill the event? That would be me negotiating with success out of am I enough? Because I am enough, the little baby, it's like, hey, I'll just talk to however many people it takes. However many people it takes to fill the event, that's what I'll do. However many times I've got to try this, how many times i got to go to the gym to lose the weight? How many times? How many times do I have to go to the gym before I lose the weight? That is negotiating with success. I am enough says, I'm going to go to the gym. That's it. There's a period right there. There's no negotiation. Well, if I miss a day, I am enough just makes it a habit. I'm going to the gym. You know, I, I wasn't going to the gym and I was doing this show every day, every day. And I was like, how can I do this show every day? And that over there is not working. It's because I was trying to negotiate the success of my wellness. And so when it dawned on me, Michael, you do this show every day. You can go to the gym every day. When that dawned on me, I just started going and doing my 30 minutes. If I do something after the 30 minutes, bonus. But every day I do the 30 minutes. And now the people in my world are like, did you get your 30 minutes in? When are you getting your 30 minutes? It's part of it. We don't need to negotiate for success. We don't need a coupon because in I am enough, you are 100% capable, 100% have everything you need to succeed. It's in that space that we created. There are no coupons for success. Hey, I love you. I care about you. Oh, I just want to hug you and tell you that you are enough. I want to hug you and tell you that you have whatever it takes to succeed. You have what it takes. Show up here, everyone, at 9 a.m. Why not you? You got so much to gain by showing up here every morning at 9 a.m. Share this video. Ready? Five, four, three, two, one. Share. Hit share right now. And lastly, get to my live event. It's June 23rd. It's 9 to 5. And we are going to blow the socks off your success. The mentality you have right now will be totally flipped. And you'll be on the road to success in a way that you have not been on the road to success. You will get certainty, confidence, and you will get courage to take your next step. Mindy says, that makes sense. I've been negotiating with success. 
Thank you, Mindy. Thank you for for letting me serve you this morning. And right now, just stop. Just stop because in I Am Enough, you have everything you need, Mindy, to succeed right now. Hey, I love you guys. No more negotiating with success.